Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to install a 2 inch ball valve onto one of these large PVC water tanks. This tank itself is 1250 gallons and when I purchased it used it did not have a ball valve on it. Um, there are a couple of options for ball valves. You can get this set up here which has the 2 inch set up here for the uh, larger pipes and then the valve itself and then the adapter inside. Um, this setup here is quite expensive but heavy duty it'll last a long time and it'll withstand weather. This is about 10 years old now and it still works perfectly um, but the cost again is, uh, is about $70 for the setup here. If you want to take a cheaper route which I've decided to do I uh, picked up one of these ball valves here. It's a two inch ball valve That they still work very well. They last a long time, and then of course the uh, the adapter to, uh, to get it together. In this video, I'm going to be using a brush and a pipe wrench and this Teflon tape. So the first step is to clean up the area where you'll be working. So there's a lot of dirt in there, as you can see. You want to get rid of that old Teflon tape. You can get a knife and uh, take that out. Use a brush as well. Get that cleaned up. So now that that area is cleaned up, I just like to dry fit everything first. So I'm just going to put that on. Just get an idea how it fits. It's actually really loose, so I'm, I don't want to at this point. Now it starts to tighten up. I will use a little bit of Teflon on it, not uh, not too much. And. Then I'm going to dry fit this, these pieces together. This should fit no problem because they are both brand new. And it is a little tight already. So I'm just going to use again a very little bit of Teflon tape on both of those. Alright, so let's put some tape on it. twice and that's good okay. and then now now I'm just going to put that into there now you can tighten it now or you can tighten it later with the wrench you yeah, also just use your wrench tighten it try not to damage the plastic it's, uh, it's quite easy. So just give that several turns until it's good and tight. There you go, so I'm satisfied with that. The, you're going to get to a point when you're tightening it, tightening it, that the whole mechanism is going to start to turn. Um, this is uh, attached to so like a gasket here to prevent leaks. Um, so that uh, that's tight enough there, so I'll put the ball valve on next. Okay, so I just put a little bit of Teflon on, and now I'm just going to put the valve on. The valve is actually really slippery and hard to turn. And it's already very tight. So. What I need to do here is use some gloves. So I'm going to use some gloves, tighten it up, and I'll show you what it looks like. So there you have it. The uh, ball valve is installed. Ready to be used. It's extremely stiff. Turn, but once it gets used, you have some bit of water in there. Probably make it easier. Thanks for watching the video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more of my outdoor projects, please subscribe.